Florida. This is a freaking unicorn bag. I just. <laughs> My name is Sarah. Welcome to my channel or welcome back. Uh, today I'm gonna do a Louis Vuitton unboxing with you. As you can see, here's the here's the box. Eee! Okay, um, this was a sort of a special last minute item. I reached out to an, a CA, a, a CA and, uh, that I haven't worked with before and um, he made it happen. So let's show it. Okay, so it comes with a the full box and this fun little tab on top. So I'm gonna leave it in background. Pull the tie. Oh, Charlie wants to help unbox. Hi, Charlie. You gonna help me unbox this? All right, so let's get the ribbon off. Okay, and I don't know how they tie the ribbon, but they do it so it's a flat back. You don't have to twist and loop. It's always magical to me. So. Now we have the top section. I can get it, it's magnetized. Okay. And here it is. Have the receipt. It will focus on not me for a second. The receipt here, they always come in these lovely printed cards. And then I think right now there's this, um, 200 trunks exhi exhibition going on. So, there's some information on that. Okay, so, it's open. I got the, the Louis blue sticker here and some lovely paper. The paper is almost like the Damier Abine print where it's checkered. Okay, so let's see. Oh, it seems like it's upside down. So, I'm gonna grab it right here. Okay, oh my goodness, I'm so excited. I have not actually seen this, so I waited to unbox this with so, you. So, what do you think it is? Okay, so like I was saying, um, I had the opportunity to purchase this. Uh, I saw a CA uh, post about it on Instagram, and um, I was surprised that there was even one still available, so I, I wrote to him and I said, hey, is this one taken? And he did say, yes, this one's taken, but let me look on finding another one for you. So I instantly jumped on it. I just couldn't, um, I couldn't, uh, <laughs> I couldn't not get it. So, all right. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, <laughs> oh my goodness. This is the um, Sunrise Pastel Keep All 45. Oh my goodness. I don't know if uh, the camera is going to do this justice of any kind. Look at it. <laughs> Isn't it just gorgeous? Oh. So the Sunrise uh, Pastel Collection, the canvas is actually made differently than than most canvas releases. So the uh, monogram, uh, you can see they're kind of shiny. So they're uh, they're actually sort of embossed. It's not it's not part of the print. It's over on top. And I'm going to try to include this. They are actually sparkly. I mean, genuinely sparkly. So funny comparison versus this or the Stardust. I would say this is more sparkly than the Stardust collection. Oh wow, this is just gorgeous. And the sides have the uh, LVs as well. And you can see it's like top gradient, like a, a blue, like a light blue into a pink. And the LVs are purple, <laughs> the monogram is purple. <laughs> oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Oh, and the, the luggage tag is a gorgeous blue, and the uh, glazing, let me see if I can pull it up so that you guys can see it. The glazing is actually pink. I don't know if that's gonna come up, I hope it is. I'm gonna have to insert some pictures here. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, they, they just, oh my goodness. So the reason I picked this one up, or I, I wanted it, and then took the opportunity to purchase it, 
um, was we travel to Florida a lot and uh, in Florida it does tend to be wet and rainy sometimes <laughs> and uh, with the other keep ball that I have, the keep ball 50, it does have pre-treated vachetta, but it's still it's still raw vachetta, so it will pick up water marks. I do try and protect it with Apple Guard. I just we got caught in the rain a couple times in other places, so I just didn't want to risk it. And this this is all canvas, so even the handles are. And then you can see very 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 shiny gold hardware. Oh wow, oh, it's very light too. I mean, I, I oh. So this side has the blue, and they actually did a really good job with the seamless, to the purple, and the, the uh, monograms are the, the monogram for fleur-de-lis, and the LV is pink and has a gradient purple. Now this is two pieces of canvas, which is not typical. Um, I'm stuck but they do match each side and they did a great job matching this, the strapping canvas too. It is just so well done. So let's look at the inside. I think if I remember correctly, the inside uh, was like a purple color and my CA did stuff it. So it was so cute when it arrived. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm sorry. I feel like such a kid right now. Oh wow, okay, so this looks like it's leather. Yes. Okay, the strap is leather and it looks to be predominantly purple. It looks like it's all purple. Looks like it's all purple. The strap is the blue and the glazing is pink. Wow, they just, they did it. Oh, Charlie sees uh, some of the light bouncing onto the walls so there's a reflection and she's I'm gonna go all the time. So oh it's made in France. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm gonna try and de stuff. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's gorgeous. The inside and I hope it'll capture it. The inside has the uh Fleur de Lis and an L V in purple and pink. And then the inside is kind of like a, I don't, I don't know if it would be lilac. It's a light purple. Oh my goodness. Look at how gorgeous it is. Comes with a D ring and here it is. Oh, and here's the keys. Oh, oh it smells good too. I'm, I'm so grateful to have this in my collection. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I, I wish I wish you guys could see. It's like actually sparkly. I don't know if pictures will do it justice. I know um, Megan, Megan, I'll, I'll tag her. She, she ended up getting one of these and when I saw her unbox it, I was just, oh, so impressed. Um, it is actually very well made. It's like sturdy canvas, I don't know. Um, so this is the uh, Keep All 45. I do have the Keep All 50, um, which is five centimeters longer. That's the, just about the only difference. Um, I can do a comparison of what fits in either. If that's something you're looking for, let me know. Um, I think the 45, I'm, I'm hoping it's not too small for me. I'm working on uh, packing skills, I guess, or, or packing techniques that would allow me to fit things more comfortably and uh, more efficiently so I can fit multiple outfits and maybe maybe not have too many shoes or things like that but um yeah wow I am so impressed by this I am just absolutely so impressed it is so pretty and then, you know what's so funny is that in the light with the sun so the sun is actually shining through the window behind me the interior is semi blue maybe maybe like a, a blend between a lilac and a periwinkle, but it is absolutely stunning. Like I said, I, I, I jumped on this piece because it is completely waterproof, so it's complete canvas all around. Um, so I won't have to worry about taking it out in the rain uh, when we do travel to Florida. This is a freaking unicorn bag. I just... <laughs> It's so pretty. I wish, 
I hope you guys will be able to see. <laughs> All right, I'll stand up uh, and show you the size against my body. This will be used as a as a travel piece, of course. So this is going to be. Uh, a carry-on most likely um, for when we do travel to Florida or anything like that. I think we have a, a cruise coming up so I can I can take this. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. I feel like a kid in a candy store. You know, again, and it's moments like these that just make me very grateful for where I am in my life and uh, I, I feel so just humbled to be where I'm at. So I'm, I'm very grateful and if you guys are, are just starting out or if you're into luxury things, you know, um, I, I hope that you are able to get anything in this life that you want and work for it. And, you know, all of us who work hard, we deserve nice things and we deserve to enjoy them. So again, I will be using this piece. This is not going to just sit in a, in a shelf somewhere, sit on a shelf or in a, in a container. This will, this will go places with me. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. Okay, give me a second. <laughs> I'll do some mod shots. Okay, so I'm standing up in my uh, living room, so I just wanted to show you this keep all against my body. So this is how I would typically wear it. I would keep it on the longest setting, and it is only air. It's only packed with air right now, so it's a little bit light, but oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, isn't she just stunning? Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is going to be a unicorn bag no matter where you go. Oh. So I have seen people use these as gym bags. I'm not sure how I feel about that. I just don't know. I think a, a Louis Vuitton gym bag is a little excessive, but some would say that I'm excessive for having a few luxury bags myself, so. How do you guys use a key ball? Do you guys <laughs> oh my goodness so I know some people do carry them in the crook of their arm I will say these bags do tend to get heavy so um, walking around the airport with you just like holding it like this your arm will get uh, a little exhausted but I do keep the handle thingies I don't remember what it's called on on both my key balls typically so that I can just travel through the airport you know holding it and walking um, Oh wow I'll try it crossbody. I don't think it'll really work for me. Um, I have seen some people kind of do like a like a sort of side style where it's on your back, but that's it, when it's heavy. It's really hard to do something like that. So, <laughs> oh my goodness, I just love this so much. What do you guys think? Um, do you think this keep all is beautiful or let me know if you think it's just tacky and stupid. You know, I think it's really wonderful that we can all have such different tastes and some people might not admire some things and other people love others. So, you know, I'm very grateful to have this in my collection. I look forward to using it. Oh, I do look forward to using it. I hope Charlie's playing with some of the air wrap. Um, oh man. All right. <laughs> Oh, that's so pretty. All right, friends. Well, thank you so much for joining me today with my uh, Louis Vuitton Keep All 45 unboxing. Um, thank you so much for watching. Comment down below. Let me know what you think. Let me know if this is something you're interested in. Um, I plan to do some more videos about individual reviews of bags that I have. Uh, take a look at my 2022 handbag collection video and let me know if there's any specific bag you'd like me to review for you. Um, Consider subscribing. It's free. It doesn't hurt you. I'm looking to, you know, grow my channel.